Afternoon all. Well, this morning I headed down to Robinvale on Euston just to have a look at the current conditions of the Murray River there. So stick around. Driving through Mildura at the moment on our way, but on the left hand side there, that building there used to be the old Star Bar nightclub. There's now a bit of retail and some offices upstairs and a restaurant. But if it wasn't for that place, I probably wouldn't be married. So uh, they get a little bit of a shiver down my spine every time I drive past there. The old TNG clock on the left hand side there, that was once uh, Mildura's original heritage radio station was there, 3MA. Town's a bit quiet today, Melbourne Cup public holiday, so there's not many cars about. Straight ahead you'll see the fountain there that was opened by uh, King Charles and Lady Di. It was a pretty big day by memory, I was only a kid, but the afternoon off school to go down there. Um, by memory, I reckon it was 1985. You can tell me if I'm wrong. We're now about to head over the George Chafee Bridge, named after a bloke that helped set up the irrigation settlement here in Mildura many, many years ago. Coming into Goal Goal now. Nice little spot, great place for viewing the river from here. Goal Goal Public School on the left, tennis courts on the right, and just a little bit further is the Goal Goal Pub. And there she is on the right, the Gold Gold Hotel. So we'll see how we go for time. We might even stop in there on the way back. cafes and takeaway shops and hotel, caravan park and things on the way down here as we head towards the club.
Okay, we're at the Euston Club. This isn't the main entrance. This is just the, the rear entrance that gives you access to the river and the boat ramp. So we'll cruise down and have a look, bit of a look. Check that out, that has come up stacked. So I was here six weeks ago, and in a second I'll put the uh, little video up of what it looked like six weeks ago. Far out before I remember out of the car, so it looks massive. Wow, you wouldn't know it, but uh, there's steps down there to the riverbank, two levels. You can see the insert video there. Now don't look at the, the jetty there as a reference, because the jetty's been moved up further. But um, in that insert video, as I spin around, you'll see there's, there's quite a few steps and a bit of grass down there. So if I was standing where I was standing in that video, I reckon I'd be a little deep in water. Rightio, well we'll keep cruising towards Robinvale. Well, this is on the side of the road between Euston and Romvale. Now, normally this is just a dry flood plan, but she is choppers. I'll stop a little bit further up too and see if we can get a little bit different viewpoint. Well, we're at the Robinvale Caravan Park, and as you can see, all those powered sites are pretty much underwater. There's a few cabins to my left that are still right to go. I don't know if they're, if they're renting them out or not, but, Jesus, stacks of water. Um, we'll wander down a little bit further and have a look. The water is starting to get a bit dark here, but it's not as bad as what it is in Muldura. Um, so hopefully they don't get too many fish kills here, but it's going to travel through the park before it gets to Muldura, the National Park. So um, we'll see what happens down the track. So here we are behind the Murray Valley Aboriginal Co-op. The river's come up quite a bit since I was here last, and there's that reference video. And those trees out there in the middle of the river, that's probably a good indication. So maybe it's come up a metre. It's, it's a bit hard to tell. We'll move down to the left of the river, downstream a little bit. There's a um, barbecue area that, there that might give us a reference for later on. So there's that barbecue area down there. So I don't think anybody will be having a barbie anytime soon. So we did manage to get a bit of time up our sleeves to stop at the Gold Gold Hotel on our way back. Um, there's some images of the food and bits and pieces here, but during summer this is a great place. 
um, boats pull up down the river, wander up for a feed or, or a drink. We might wander down to the river and see how bad it really is down there. Well, there she is. Geez, that stacks of water. The, don't get me wrong, the pub will be safe here unless it's unless it's a record-breaking flood, the, the pub will be safe. But you can see way out there where um, boats and houseboats normally tie up and wander up. Rip a little place. Anyhow, that's it for now. Thanks very much for watching, guys, and we'll see you next time.